This is the fly we're going to tie today, and it's just a real simple beadhead uh, pheasant tail. Pheasant tail looks like a lot of different mayfly nymphs, and the only difference between this and the usual one is we get a little bit of a red hot spot that we put on this. So here's how we tie it. A number 14 jig hook with a copper cone. We'll get our thread started right up near the cone. Trim that, and we're going to take and put a piece of lead-free wire. That's going to fill that hole in that cone, and we're going to bind that down. That'll make for a nice head of the fly when we're finished. I'm going to just trim that, kind of at an angle. Use wire cutters so I don't wreck my scissors. I'm gonna take a pair of jeweler pliers. Just make sure I got that all pinched down so it's not gonna cut the thread. I'm gonna take and get that down all the way to the back. I'm gonna grab three pheasant tail fibers for a tail. Get those tied in. Bind them back down towards that gap of that wire. And this piece I'm going to cut. Next piece coming in, I got a piece of copper wire. So now I got a nice smooth transition to my body. Get that all the way to the back. Now I'm going to come in, I got a little bit bigger clump of pheasant tail, I got about five fibers. And we're going to tie that in by the tip. And we're going to wrap those clockwise. Get about two wraps, and I'm just going to leave that. Now my copper wire, I'm going to wrap counterclockwise. And what that does is that makes the fly more durable because if a trout digs its teeth into those, it'll wreck it. Plus, it gives it a little flash into the body. I'll bring that up. Catch it and bind it down. Trim that. Next piece, just a piece of peacock curl. Get that in. And I'm just going to take that and wrap that in. Three, four turns. Trim that off. And take go back to the pheasant tail. I'm going to get three legs for each side. So I'm going to get a clump of three and a clump of three, and we'll do both sides. So I've got three for one side, and we're going to make some legs. We'll do those at about a 45 degree angle. There's one bunch.
And here's my other bunch. Trim that. Bring the back down. Catch that. Trim that. I'm just going to use that red thread, make a little hot spot, whip finish. Just going to use the little UV cure. That's a little too much actually. On my hot spot and up on my uh, wing case. Hit it with the light. And there it is. Hope you enjoyed the tying video. Please help us out and like and subscribe to the channel and send us any comments that you have. Also, please remember the 2023 holiday giveaway is going on. So from now until the end of 23, we will be giving away one of each of my fly fishing books and some of the flies from uh, the videos that we tied this year. So to enter, send in a comment with a picture of you and a fish and everybody that sends me one of their fish pictures will be entered into a drawing for those prizes. Thanks for watching.